world has gone remote and more than ever, people are looking to take their work with them around the world. Are you looking for a company that will let you work from anywhere and not just anywhere USA? Then you've come to the right place. Tune in as I go over the 14 top countries that allow you to work from anywhere in the world. Really? Hey, if you're new here, my name is Seppi, rhymes with Peppy from SheHitRefresh.com, and I help women age 30 and over break free from a life of routine and move abroad or travel the world long term. I myself did just that when at 35 years old, I moved from Texas to Spain. I'm now 42, still here in Spain and loving my life. And I have to say, moving here to Spain was the best decision of my 30s by far. Thank you for being here. On this channel, I talk about moving abroad, specifically for U.S. citizens. And I'd love to invite you to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any of my move abroad content. So remote work, which was supposed to be a temporary solution to the pandemic, actually became a permanent solution for many companies. But as we know, not all. Some employers are moving to a hybrid model, allowing employees to work some days from the office and some days from home. But there are companies that are also going back to the old ways and issuing five day in office work mandates. And that can be a real bummer for those of us who are able to experience working from home and really love this new lifestyle and the freedom that it gives us. But the good thing is, is that there are companies out there that had a great experience from having a remote team and saw the benefits and have actually taken a very radical approach to remote work, which is allowing their workforce to work globally remotely. Yes, you heard me right. These companies are allowing their employees to work from anywhere in the world. And what's really cool is that some of these companies were even doing this even before the pandemic. But I think the biggest problem out there is finding these companies. I have to say probably the number one question and complaint I get is for people who want to untether their lives so they can be anywhere in the world, but they just can't find the remote job that will let them do that. They're doing their job searches on Indeed and LinkedIn or wherever they are online, and they do find remote jobs, but all those remote jobs, I would say 90% of them are coming with those conditions of having to work from a specific time zone or a specific region, and usually that's tied to the US. Now, there are a lot of reasons why companies may not be able to allow their workforce to work from anywhere in the world, but that is for a separate video. But if you are looking to work remotely, you are in the right place because I'm here to help you. I did the research and uncovered 14 incredible companies that are fully remote and allow their employees to work from anywhere. You gotta check them out. But before we do, I wanna dive into my weekly shout out. And I wanna give a shout out to Stuart Thomas for his comment on my video, 15 tips to moving abroad alone. Stuart says, hello, I will be retiring in 15 months and would like to retire in Portugal or Valencia, Spain. What I'm most worried about are taxes. Is the tax situation as scary as folks say? So this is a great question. And I did answer Stuart's question in the comments of my uh, Move Abroad Alone video, but I'll give you a, a quick little answer here. And the answer is that, well, it's hard to answer because taxes vary greatly by country and depend on a few things including your earnings, your assets, and also how many days you're residing in a country. So there are a lot of variables. I should probably do a whole separate video on taxes. Even though I'm not an expert, I can share what I know and I know that might be useful. But in any case, I always recommend that it's best to speak to a certified expert who can help you understand what your tax implications will be if you move to whichever country you desire. So definitely look for an expert who specializes in expat taxes. And a lot of times you can find these through word of mouth in the Facebook groups for expats in, let's say if you move to Spain, expats in Spain or expats in France or expats in Costa Rica. Um, in those groups, you can uh, connect with other expats or other Americans or foreigners who have made the move and can give you some information and maybe recommend a really good uh, tax attorney. Okay, enough about taxes. The moment you've all been waiting for, let's dive in here into the top 14 companies that let you work from anywhere in the world. So the first company on our list is Atlassian. So Atlassian is an Australian software company and they create tools like Trello or Jira. So if you're a project manager or software developer, you may have used some of these tools or you may be using these tools. So Atlassian has headquarters in Australia, the US, 
and in Europe, and in August 2020, they just introduced their Team Anywhere program. So Team Anywhere is a distributed work policy, giving people more control over where they wanna live and work, allowing them to make choices to support their family, personal goals, and life priorities. That's how they put it. So I'm gonna drop the link to Atlassian and all the other companies that I mentioned below. For Atlassian, if you're looking for jobs in the categories of program management, legal, IT, or security, definitely take a look. Next on our list is Automatic. So Automatic is behind platforms that you may have heard of like WordPress.com, Tumblr, Jetpack, and WooCommerce. Automatic's goal is to democratize publishing and commerce so that anyone with a story can tell it and anyone with a product can sell it. Automatic has some great perks to working there. You can get benefits such as career coaching, you get a wellness stipend, home office setup, and even a co-working allowance. They have an open vacation policy as many of the companies on this list do. And of course, you can choose to work from anywhere. They have hundreds of jobs open on their website. Most of these roles though are gonna be in engineering, business development, and marketing, but you can also find roles in sales, finance, and design. Okay, next on the list is Blueground. So Blueground is a real estate tech company that provides short-term housing in more than 20 cities around the world. So their product is their flexible and modern rentals that are great for digital nomads and those that need a flexible lifestyle. So what the company wanted to do was also roll out this flexibility to their employees. And so they rolled out their Blue Ground Nomads Initiative. And this program empowers employees to shape their ideal work setup in their dream location. Sounds pretty cool. They have open roles ranging from accounting, partnership development, finance, and marketing operations. And a great perk is that all employees receive complimentary and discounted accommodations at Blue Ground locations around the world. Next, we have Buffer. So Buffer is a social media scheduling application that started in 2010 to help users schedule tweets. But today, thousands of solopreneurs and entrepreneurs use Buffer to plan and publish content on Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, and now even TikTok. I actually used Buffer for a bit a few years ago when first starting She Hit Refresh to schedule all of our content on Twitter and Facebook and LinkedIn. So I really love Buffer. As an employee of Buffer, you'll enjoy benefits such as a four-day work week, yes, isn't that pretty cool? Fully paid family leave and comprehensive health insurance for both international and domestic employees. Next is Deal. So have you heard of Deal yet? Well, if not, you probably will soon. Deal is the go-to global payroll for companies that have employees in multiple currencies. And I just love their tagline that deal makes it easier than ever for companies to hire whoever they want, wherever they want. So not only are they helping companies hire global teams, they themselves also have a global team. So they have a flex work program that allows you to choose where you'd like to work from, whether that's your home, the beach, one of their offices, or elsewhere with their WeWork global membership program. So it's important to note that most of their roles are not country specific, but they may have regional requirements. So that just means that you may have to be located in the Americas or within Europe or within APAC. Asia Pacific, but that still gives you a lot of leeway to move around and be a digital nomad or just be on the go with your work. Roles at Deal range from project management, mobility and immigration, and customer success. Next is Hotjar. So a Hotjar is an analytics tool that lets businesses understand user behavior and how it impacts a product. They are a fully remote company with employees in Europe, Africa, and the Americas. But again, I wanna put a little asterisk here that they are not 100% work from anywhere, and they explain themselves why that is. Most of their roles are gonna have a dedicated time zone or regional requirements. Again, these can be very broad. It can be within Europe, within APAC, within the Americas. I still included them on this list because I think Hotjar can still provide an incredible opportunity for those who are looking to work remotely outside of the US. One thing I love about Hotjar Jar is that their compensation is based off of their market in London. And some of the perks that they have include 40 days of vacation, a vacation budget, paid leave, stock options for all of the roles, and a home budget. Those are just a few. Many of their open roles are in sales, product marketing, and customer experience. 
Next is Plio, a company I had never heard of, but Plio is an improved business spending solution for businesses across Europe. So the stress of personal out-of-pocket work expenses is no longer a problem with Plio. Most roles, but not all, allow for remote work opportunities. And a big perk about Plio is that they support relocation to Denmark including visa support. They have offices in Copenhagen, in London, Madrid, Stockholm, Berlin, Montreal, and they have over 200 people working from Eastern time to European time zones. Positions range from software engineer to data scientist to sales and so much more. The next company on my list is a personal favorite and that is Power to Fly. So I actually worked for Power to Fly in 2021 and I just love them. So Power to Fly is a diversity recruiting and retention platform dedicated to fast tracking economic quality by upskilling and connecting underrepresented talent to roles in highly visible sectors. And they have employees spanning the Americas, Europe, Middle East, Africa, Asia Pacific, they are truly a global 100% remote team. And they were even before the pandemic. And I also love that one of their core values is having a global team first. What I also love about Power to Fly is that they're women-led, intersectional, and they encourage employees to show up as their most authentic self. Open roles are in all departments, especially in tech and marketing. So definitely check out their website below. Next up is Remote. So Remote is a relatively new company. They were founded in 2019 and like Deal, they help global organizations employ anyone, anywhere compliantly. So they are fully remote, asynchronous team with employees all around the world. So Remote has a really cool total rewards policy that they adhere to, and that ensures that a worldwide minimum salary of 40,000 USDs is always paid, even if the local minimum wage is much lower. Some additional perks are unlimited paid time off and of course, company stock options. For Remote, you can find roles in sales, finance, and HR. Next up is a company that I'm pretty sure you've heard of, and that is Spotify. So your favorite music app, Spotify, actually has a really new work from anywhere program. And they say that it gives their people the freedom to work where they work best, wherever that may be. But I'm gonna put another little asterisk here because there are a few caveats with this initial rollout of the program. So currently employees can only work remotely in the region where their role is based, and that's to ensure an overlap of working hours between team members. So if you are located within Europe, then you can work remotely within Europe. If you're located in the Americas, then you can work remotely within that time zone of the Americas for example. Another thing to be mindful of is that Spotify needs to have a legal entity in the country where you wish to work to even consider the remote possibility there. So that means if they don't have an office, let's say in Cape Town, South Africa, then you wouldn't be able to work remotely from there. But that shouldn't be a problem with Spotify because they have five locations in the Americas, 11 in EMEA, that's Europe in the Middle East, and six in APAC, Asia Pacific. Spotify has a wide range of open roles from everything from engineering to sales to content design to global affairs and more. Okay, we just have four left. And next on the list is Test Gorilla. So Test Gorilla is an HR software that it helps employers with pre-employment tests that facilitate faster and more bias-free hiring decisions. So they are a startup that does not have an office and they provide the opportunity to work in numerous countries around the world. Some of their perks are flexible vacation time and also a remote working budget. So open roles at Test Gorilla include SEO specialist, customer success advisor, front end engineer, and data analyst. Next on the list is actually a tool that I've used before, and this company is Toggle. So Toggle creates products that aim to eliminate stress from the workplace. They have their time tracking, products, project planning, and hiring tools that allow companies to boost productivity and enhance reports for work and project planning. They've actually been fully remote since 2014 and have employees in 40 plus different countries. Toggle's benefits include 24 days of paid time off, reimbursement for co-working and gym memberships, and multiple team building meetups a year around the world. Next, we have TopTal. So TopTal is a freelancing platform that connects top organizations with business, design, and tech talent 
from all around the world. So they've actually been fully remote since their founding in 2010, so for 12 years now, and they claim to be the largest fully distributed company, that means fully remote around the world, with over 1,000 employees in 90 plus countries. Pretty incredible. So some of the perks of working at TopTal include working from anywhere as long as you have Wi-Fi and a laptop, flexible time off, and company-sponsored events. Career opportunities include, but are not limited to, strategy, publication, business operations, and product. All right, we have gotten to the last company that allows you to work from anywhere. And this is actually another tool that I use and this is Zapier. So Zapier is an online product that helps automate workflows by connecting apps and services. So they have employees in 17 time zones across 28 countries. And so they truly are a company that understands asynchronous communication and working autonomously. And so much so that they've been recognized as one of the best remote first companies out there. Perks include unlimited vacation, stock options, learning stipend, and paid parental leave. If you're interested in healthcare or retirement plans, right now those are only currently available in the UK, Canada, the US, New Zealand, and Australia. Open roles include accounting, engineering, support, insights and design, and people and products. Phew, we did it. Those are the top 14 companies that will empower you and allow you to work from anywhere. I really hope you found this video useful. And if I've missed any companies that you think should be on this list, please let me know. I do wanna point out that I purposely did not include Airbnbs and HubSpot. I know those companies come up a lot on the work from anywhere, but they actually have programs that are only limited to 90 days of working abroad a year. So didn't really meet the criteria for this particular video. And if you're in need of some more resources, please check out my digital guide. I'm out of here an American's ultimate visa guide to living in Europe. So if you're interested in moving to Europe, check out my guide. I go over the 17 easiest countries to move to in Europe and give you over 50 viable visa options to choose from. If you're a woman age 30 and over, please join my online community. She hit refresh. And that's for women 30 and over who want to move abroad or travel the world long term. You'll find over 10,000 women in there that you can connect with and tons of inspiration, resources, and support to make your remote dreams come true. And last but not least, as always, if you enjoyed this video, please give me a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on notifications so that you don't miss out on any future Move Abroad content.